Hi everyone, it's Veronica and I am here today to give a shout out to those crafters who are participating in my series, Case of the Forgotten Pens. And in case you're just joining me regarding the series, it's a series where I'm taking pens from boards that I have on Pinterest that I have done nothing with and creating those projects. It could be cards, it could be uh, any type of crafty project. So I just wanted to say thank you, thank you, thank you to those crafters who are participating and encourage you to go to their channels to see what they have created with the pens that they have cased and also just to show them some YouTube love by visiting and subscribing to their channels. I will have a link in the description box to um, their videos, hopefully all of them. Um, and if I somehow missed your video regarding my series, please just send me a message. It was not intentional, but I did do a search and these are the ones that I wanted to say thank you to. And they are Stamp Girl, who is Paige, Slim Cards, who is Shonda, and Fun Creations, who is Lucretia. Now, what you see in front of you are some of the cards and a project that I created from my pens. I have um, done several types and I do have my boards uh, broken down pr pretty much, pretty much. I still have some breaking down to do um, into groups. So these are the mail cards that I have done. And I did go back on this one and add that bow tie. So these could be birthday cards, uh, congratulatory cards, cards of any type. This in particular was a birthday card, which I just absolutely love. And I will also have a link to my playlist in the description box so that you can go back and check these out if you have not seen them. So those were the male ones. Oh, I'm sorry, this birthday one. I also recently did some baby cards. So those are the baby cards. And, uh oh, I missed a couple. All right, now those are the baby cards. Okay, cards for babies. I have uh, some other birthday cards. And these particularly are for females. And uh, I am missing one of the cards. It was this shoe that I had done in red glitter. And it's missing because I had to use it. And that's one of the purposes for my um, series is to also create a stash for myself. This one didn't have a sentiment, but it could be birthday or any type of card. And I also did this little mini. It was a one sheet mini, which I thought turned out so cute, but I don't want to go through the entire thing. Again, I will have a link to my playlist in the description box, and that's the back side. So please, please, please come along, join the fun, check out those who have created and I guarantee you will be duly inspired to create some of your own. It's just amazing how I can just sit and just pin, pin, pin while I'm sitting watching a movie or just doing absolutely nothing. Um, and then have all these pins and go back through them and think, wow, this is really, really nice. So I just had to get to the point where I did something with it. And it, it, it really has been fun. Really, really, and I, as you see, I'm creating a stash of cards for me to use when I need them. So thank you again, Paige, Shonda, and Lucretia. Thank you so, so much for participating. I have not put an end date on the series yet. I started in January, and it's the first and third Saturdays in um, each month. But I probably will be ending soon so um, please jump in 
and show us some of the pens that you have because I'm sure I have missed a lot. And it's not like I've stopped pinning. I still do some. But these are ones that I have already had that I'm casing. And casing is copying and selectively editing. So uh, you pretty much make it your own, but it's very similar to the uh, inspiration. So thank you all for stopping by. Again, the links for everything will be in the description box. Make sure you check that out. And happy crafting.